A local bus manufacturing company is shifting production into high gear. Governor Rick Snyder on hand today in Owasso for the announcement of the Midwest Bus Corporation. NBC 25's Walter Smith Randolph on our newsroom right now with more on the local impact to all of this. Good news, huh, Walter? Yes, that's right, Bill. Owasso may be a small town, but the impact is huge. The new jobs are a result of a two-year, $31 million contract with the Massachusetts Bay Transportation Authority. For some workers at the company that refurbishes buses, this is a sign of job security in tough economic times. Aaron Platt knows firsthand what it means to be unemployed. I've lived here most of my life. I've seen a lot of people go in and out of work, including myself. Now, he's three months on the job at the Midwest Bus Corporation in his hometown. It means a lot for my family. It allows me to put food on the table, no worries anymore. The worries of unemployment may soon fade for a lot of people in mid-Michigan. Thanks to a new contract, the hums of bus manufacturing growing louder in Owasso. 100 new full-time jobs heading to this plant. It's flattering, the fact that what we're doing has brought enough attention that it's actually being noticed in the public. The work here also grabbing the attention of Governor Rick Snyder. Well, 100 jobs in Owasso or any place in Michigan is important because we're talking about people's families and the chance to be successful and grow and have a place where we can keep our kids here. Taking that chance at success right here in Owasso. In fact, Platt is letting his friends know the now hiring sign is going up. They've actually told me that if I know any workers, people that need jobs, their only uh, requirement is someone that wants to work. Now this is the company's largest project in its 33 year history. Company officials say you don't have to live in Shiawassee County to apply for a job. In the newsroom, Walter Smith Randolph, NBC 25 News. Bill. Thanks, Walter.